guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl miss Furaha here thank you so much for coming back to watch my videos i appreciate you a lot thank you thank you so much and if you're new to this channel welcome to the Furaha squad make sure you subscribe below and hit that bell so that you get notified every time i post a video so today's is a um, vlogmas day day 12 day 13 vlogmas day 13 guys and according to the title as you saw i'm preparing a romantic uh dinner date with my boyfriend to celebrate a little anniversary there <laughs> yeah i'm not giving much details but maybe in future you're gonna know so it's anniversary today so i just want us to have a very cozy romantic dinner at home on a budget yeah you know we're on a budget so we have to save every coin but we had to do this to just make memories yes and also to show you guys that you can do this at the comfort of your home and you can just have a good time and have a date at home okay so i hope you enjoy this vlog guys and if you do give it a thumbs up and comment below so i'm wearing this comfort jumpsuit because i'm gonna be doing a lot right about now i just wanna go pick some uh, items i i sent my brother to town because i can't find some items here so i'm going to pick them and then after that i'll hop in the supermarket and just pick a few things i also need uh to go to the butchery some little grocery shopping there so that i can be able to start preparing so let's go guys <laughs> shopping and it rained heavily guys you should see my jumpsuit it's really wet really wet most of the items here have been rained on <laughs> yeah but i'm gonna sort it out so i just wanna show you what i got and yeah what i got so that you can know what to buy if you want to replicate this okay the items i got from town are these roses yeah so uh one is 50 bob i'm gonna insert the prices so that you can see how much you can spend okay so one is 50 bob so i opted to get three of them so this one i'm not gonna let put in a there's something i'm gonna do with them okay <laughs> so i decided to get two red and white roses just to break the monotony of the red roses so that's the first thing i got and then i got some berries uh, these are strawberries, fresh strawberries, and I got uh, blueberries too. Yes, and these are how much are these? Just a minute, I see the price. Uh, I don't have the receipt for this, but you choose whatever is uh, affordable for you. As you can see, this is just like a a, a quarter of a kg, and this is a uh, two hundred and fifty. Uh, grams so you can just pick whatever it's a uh, it's affordable for you you don't need to go like this size okay and then i also got this uh curry flour here and uh french beans these items i got them from town the one that I told you i uh, sent my brother and i got this uh 
candles right here very affordable so most of the items i got they are less than a thousand from town all the items i got the flowers the berries the candle and that's less than a thousand okay so let me show you what i got locally here some potatoes they've been rained on so they look pretty bad <laughs> but i'm gonna sort this out okay uh because the uh, the meal i'm gonna prepare it involves potatoes so that's why i bought that one so you can just play around with your favorite meal or your partner's favorite meal it doesn't have to be exact meal but if you want to replicate this you're welcome so i got a foil and film clean film and aluminum foil i ran out of this and i need them for the green part and uh, i got ooh, George. i got some beef beef steak here which is just needs to be there i ran out of ketchup guys so i had to get some ketchup and these are always on offer i needed only one but why not because you buy one you get another one so i had to go with this and uh i got mayonnaise too before i forget i also got chocolate guys and you can also buy this size or the one is the one that is cheaper than this you just need you don't need much chocolate okay but this one is only 160 so you can also go with this okay and then i just got some tissues and some wipes i ran out of wipes so that's basically it and guys there are these items that i bought that you don't need on your budget if you have uh these items in your house you don't need this so you can minus this from your budget i just bought these cute cute balls two balls these are just a table and then i needed a tray that's why i'm saying if you have all the utensils you don't need this <laughs> so i got this tray also it's a cute one it's been random i'm gonna wash it so that it can be pretty yeah so that's it that's it so this day should be like a picnic in the house some sort of so i want it to be cozy i don't want to be like too much pressure just us chilling and eating good food and just catch up okay so if you have this minus this from your your budget so that's basically it right about now i just need to clean this house because that's the first thing you do you can you can't go to a dirty place right <laughs> so i need to clean my utensils and also uh, my sitting area just a bit and then i start maybe cooking before i prepare myself okay so let's do that i had to change to a warm cloth because i told you i was rained on so i'm just in this um uh, hoodie and shorts so that i can be able to sort the sitting room you can see the mess guys <laughs> it's so disorganized so i want to sort this one so that it can be clean so that after cooking i just go straight to shower and to prepare myself okay so let's do that real quick it's just that the clutter and i'm gonna like wipe at the stand here just to feel fresh in here you know so that can bring the vibe yeah so let's do that guys and just sweep away the particles here because i'm gonna set up on the carpet right here i'm just gonna sit on the couch yeah i just want it to be just cozy and comfortable so this is my picnic uh, cloth so i'm gonna just 
lay it here that's it guys uh this is i'm gonna leave it the way it is right now let me go to the kitchen now and sort everything there and then after when i'm setting up the food and everything then i'm gonna show you okay the first thing i'm gonna do in the kitchen is to prepare my strawberry i've seen these recipes all over i don't know how it tastes but i'm gonna try it today so i have here my this is dark chocolate made chocolate with extra cocoa we love the the other one caramel yeah salt caramel one but for now with the strawberry i didn't want the saltness so i went for the dark milk chocolate with extra cocoa and i have my strawberries here so what i'm gonna do is just to melt this chocolate and then i'm gonna dip my strawberry in there and then after that i'm gonna put them in the free in the freezer so that's why that's the first thing i'm gonna do before i do anything else so that's why i bought this bowl guys to put the strawberry i think they'll be so cute look at that Ooh, i love the aesthetic i love uh, my utensils black or white by the way so let me just put them here wash them i think i'm gonna remove this they look so good with this leafy but i think for for the purpose of eating i think it should be easier for me to remove them and i'm missing a straw i saw this hack uh people are doing it's like you take a straw and just pull it here put it here and then it can pull this one out but i don't have a straw right now so i'm just gonna go ahead and just cut them and then do the rest of the stuff okay so i'm gonna cut them and wash them so they are now more edible right yeah so that's more like it before i wash them i'm gonna melt the chocolate first so that when i'm done washing them i just dip them and put them in the freezer yes so i'm gonna use this to melt the chocolate with let me just open it and there you go so I'm not gonna use all of it. I'm gonna spare some for us to just snack on. So I guess like this bar is enough. If it's not enough, I'm gonna add some. So let me first melt this one. So as that is melting, let me wash this one. I've never melted chocolate in the microwave. This is my first time. It's just making funny, funny noises. But it's actually melting. So I have to leave it to melt. I don't know. I, I think I have to leave it. So look at that. It has melted, but it's not really uh, running. So let me just leave it for it to melt completely has melted guys it's still running i think i'm gonna use the defrost button instead of warming it up because it's getting cooked i'm struggling with this but we have to make this happen that was a fail total fail <laughs> so i'm gonna try to defrost it instead of warming it up if it will work if it won't work then we're gonna have the strawberry as they are because it's never that serious okay And I'm gonna use uh, this plate. So cross the fingers. This worked, guys. Look at that. The chocolate is melting with the right consistency. Oh yes, 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 yes. At least now I'm happy yeah this is what i was talking about yeah yes so i'm not gonna cut all the all the strawberry because i'm not sure if uh my boyfriend gonna like them so i'm just gonna cut part of them and then the rest we're gonna eat them like that okay 
So all you do is just to smear it on the chocolate like that. I finally managed to coat some of the strawberry here there so I'm gonna put them in the freezer and I also have this bowl that has the fresh strawberry without the chocolate and the blueberries I think they look so good this is what we're gonna have for dessert so I'm gonna put this in the fridge and then I deal with the the beef first before I sort out my veggies okay so let me do that I'm glad that I I had this but I had to do minimal so that I can see how it tastes and then I'm going to perfect it with time, okay? Yeah, it's all about trying. You know what we do? It's time to make the steak. I didn't get the best of the best, but it's not that bad, as you can see. So I just want to marinate it. Just putting a black pepper, paprika, and salt so that I can be able to sear it in the pan. And then it goes in the oven. And then I deal with the potatoes. And then afterwards, I deal with the veggies. The veggies are going to be the last because they don't have so much work. So here it is. Let me get the spices and then we start this recipe. prepare yourself as if you're going out for a date okay don't just come here looking like i don't know you have to prepare so see you when i'm glammed okay hey guys so my makeup is done how do i look guys how do i look comment below i just did a simple makeup yeah i just did mascara i didn't want any lashes and i popped this lipstick that matches well with my dress so i'm gonna show you the full outfit so baby is not here i just want him to have a first reaction <laughs> yeah when he sees me okay i look cute i look cute this is basically how i'm gonna go on a date just simple makeup i love love that not just over the top so i love it
Hey guys, so Bear loved the whole outfit. Comment below how do I look? He looks so good by the way. He looks so good. He's just camera shy, guys. He's very camera shy. He's used to being behind the camera. So you can't see him clearly because he, he's just not used to be in front of the camera. So you'll excuse that part, but you know he's here. Although you won't see exactly his face until he's ready to do that. Yeah. So yeah, I look good. So let's set a picnic up so that we can have this hot steamy bed and we go wine. So let's do this. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. Chasing, leading us, and love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah, no, I don't wanna waste what's left. And on and on we'll go through the wastelands, through the highways, till my shadow turns to sun rays. And on show you up close how it looks like it just pretty simple but pretty cute and romantic of course so this is the simple setup guys i have some white roses and red roses i have some candles that i use aluminum foil to just make sure it doesn't drip on the floor and then i have wine there strawberry dipped in chocolate strawberry and blueberry Red sweet wine and food. It's pretty warm. So yeah, let's have this meal and enjoy the night. I forgot this guys. We need ketchup and mayo for the meal. So we are going to bring gonna say something you wanna go fast or not no, fast I go <laughs> really yeah, I ladies fast yeah always fast okay this is what you are toasting to i'm toasting to mm. thank you so much for, for an amazing time up to this time and mm. Natalie mm. you've been awesome <laughs> thank you thank you for being a loving gay friend supportive gay friend thank you for protecting me for loving me for supporting me thank you thank you so much you've been so supportive and i appreciate you i just want you to know that i appreciate you and i'm gonna be here for you and i love you so much so i hope that you're gonna celebrate this more and more and even better okay so i'm chasing to love to finding friendship within us and for just awesome partners. I, I really enjoy being back with you and I appreciate it a lot. Yeah. So cheers to that. Wow. Not <clears throat> <time. coughs> okay, so where do I start? And it's like basically just again my words from my mouth. So I don't know where to start. I knew it. No, just say yes, just say your yes, own. Yes, basically. And the fun is affecting me. Yeah. Yes. So, just took my words from my mouth and whatever I was thinking and right now I'm just blank. No, I don't you know. miss words. 
yeah, I do miss work sometimes. I know sometimes like you can tell you feel like okay, but if that don't work. But sometimes yeah anyway. Today I'm just into more days, more life. Life with you, doing life with you, you know, give me the best. I need the best of your life in my life. Yes, and um, I'm gonna take a break. Okay. Yep. So we're gonna be having more things to come then. You've been a best friend to me, you've been a friend, best friend. Mm-hmm. And that's something I really appreciate. Cheers to love and to many love. more anniversaries. To many more anniversaries, to many more days. Yeah. Let's eat. amazing so we're just chilling finishing the wine and just talking and catch up and just talk about future plans and everything you know so i'm still looking cute <laughs> so this was just awesome guys and i suggest that you try it at home or maybe if you're trying it if you do it let me know in the comment section what to do differently so that i can learn from you too so the next time i can do it you know so this is my version of uh, just a romantic date at home on a budget. Nothing much. Yeah, it's all about good vibes, good conversation, cozy, and good food, of course. So I hope you've enjoyed this video, guys. And if you did, give it a thumbs up and comment below. Thank you so much for watching. See you on the next one.